after a successful first year, the Heart Math Tutoring Program is expanding in Winston-Salem for Scythe County Schools. And I'm actually one of the volunteer tutors that goes to an elementary school each week to work one-on-one -on -one with these kids, so I get to see the success for myself. And I want to show you all how and why Heart Math works. Bolton Elementary School is back in full swing. Eight. Okay. Do you want to double check for me? How many are in the green train? But for some students, it takes a little extra time. Nine. There you go. And attention to get back on track. It created a safe space for them to be able to make mistakes. That's what this room serves as. It's where heart math tutors work one on one with students. Go over things like more or less. Can you please change the pile of five so that there are eight? And changing numbers. The program coordinator for Winston-Salem Forsyth County Schools, Frida Robinson, says this format is based on math experts to help kids on the cusp. A program that supports students that come from under-resourced communities and would not otherwise have access to private tutoring. We were amazed um, at their growth. Last year, 98% of students in the program in Winston-Salem improved on their assessment scores in two or more categories. When they came back to class, they had stronger ability to access grade level skills because we were closing gaps in tutoring. It was one of the best experiences that we've had at Bolton. It's another full roster of 50 students at Bolton and 50 at Easton Elementary, up from about 20 last year. And that expansion means a need for more tutors. There's no new math, there's no algebra or um, <laughs> calculus. And Robinson always reassures people the students are all in first through third grades. How many more? The programming is scripted so anyone can do it. The willingness to help, the desire to help, the desire to give back to the community and to make an impact in our week is really all that's necessary. <laughs> I know you know this one, okay. When that aha moment, when they just realize that they, they know it, they have it, I encourage anyone to come and see that because, I mean, it's, it's beautiful. And that tutoring is free for the school district. Mm -hmm. Those kids go during the school day, so no extra transportation is required. And Jackie has spoke about how rewarding this is for you, but also the kiddos. Yeah, it, it's such a bright spot in my week, that one hour working with the same two kids all year. It makes such a difference for me and for them, of course. And you at home have the chance to participate. Tutoring starts in mid-October. So there's still time to sign Great. up. And I have the story posted on our website now, WXII12.com, with the link on how to register as well. So makes sense. As more kids get involved, oh, pound it, oh, Dylan. Thanks, good Dylan. Job, Don't Jackie. Leave that was so That's so sweet. Don't want to leave him hanging. No. Don't so as hanging. more kids get involved, obviously the need for volunteers also grows. Yeah, so. there's 100 kids now for this year. Wow. So definitely need a ton oh, of tutors. Wow. And each one gets two tutors per week so yeah it seems super easy to do too so mm -hmm. it's great to help the kids out like that